All right, so we got our bleed arrows. We are going to fight the Bellberry Hunter. We're going to do the last few bosses, at least for, in Kaled for now. We'll have to come back here in a bit, but... I think I talked to him already, so... Okay, yeah, he's gone. Good. Get out of here, merchant. Oh, it's already poisoned. Wow. That's the wrong arrow. Dude, I wasn't ready. Stop cheating. No, don't do it. He did it. I just decided I was going to tank that. Don't shoot, that's fine. Who wants to deal damage, not me. I was gonna kick out of class for doing what? the blood. There it is. Try and poison him again, too. We'll save these bleed arrows now that I can buy infinite uh, poison arrows. Crap. Easy. Stop. Can I get a shield bash or something? Ask and you shall receive. Oh, I didn't know what he was doing there. Teacher wanted over something and he should have gone went over something he should have got over a week ago, asked if we read it, and of course I didn't, only because I've read what was in the syllabus. Why'd oh, you almost get kicked out for that though? Seems a bit harsh. Oh, I went to the I didn't get the other grace. It's alright. Ah, uh, okay. So he's just in a bad mood. It's unlucky. At least he didn't get kicked out, though. I don't think I've ever broken that statue. I have no clue what's in there. Probably like smithing stones or something, I imagine.
Yeah, I can't blame you. If it went that way. Wait, is he already poisoned? Wow, that was really quick. Sir, do you stop or do you just keep doing this? I'm just gonna not use bleed arrows for this. I feel like it's a bit overkill. That is much faster than I thought it'd be. Are, are we, can I get up? Dude, like, really? That is my turn. Holy AoE. Do you like the hammer or something? Thank you. Yeah, same Cabo. I haven't been in school in almost 10 years. And I still, like, I still get, like, weird dreams about being in high school. Like, I had a dream that I somehow my high school diploma didn't count and I had to redo my senior year after I graduated from college. It was the strangest thing. And I'm like, why the hell am I going here? But like so many other people from my high school class were also going and it's just like, it just made no sense to me. It's so weird. When does the nightmare stop? Don't want to be in school. Man, this guy is so much. It's not. I, I keep saying these enemies have so much health, but they're just so insanely. No, they're not tanky. It's just this damage sucks. <laughs> it's so bad. Graduated high school in 16, got an associates in 18, finally getting a bachelor's. Nice. That's good. You know what you want to do uh, when you're done? No clue. Yeah. I mean, I still don't know what I want to do, to be honest. There are probably people who are, like, in their 50s and they don't know what they want to do, you know? What are we going to do here? Bleed, I guess? Do you have to do, uh, do you have to play an instrument to study music? I, I think at my, my college you had to play an instrument. Although maybe there's, like, music production or something, and you didn't need it for that, but... Because I had looked into doing, like, a music minor at one point, but I was not, like, proficient at any instrument. Not nearly enough to study it. Like, the only thing I really played was guitar. Do you have a specialization in technology? You have to play an instrument. Yeah, okay. Makes sense then. Checks out. I feel like you could... There probably are, like, schools you don't have to. Maybe. I don't know. Can I poison this guy? I'm gonna try it. I feel like they can just clean themselves. 
They are clean runs after all. Clean runs. Clean run. When I clean run, they don't clean poison. Damage actually isn't that bad though. It's not good, but it's not the worst. Oh, they heal. I forgot about this. Oh, please stop. It is dealing poison damage though. That's good. He's regenning, but also losing health because of the poison. Keep doing that. Keep staggering. This guy takes way more damage than the other dude did. And by way more damage, I mean like 1% more, probably. <laughs> I think his health bar is lower. He's poisoned. Big bleed. Had a dream recently about a friend's ex-girlfriend he dated back in grade 12. Couldn't remember her name. Asked a friend and she knew. Yeah, the brain is uh pretty crazy, right? I feel like there's a lot of things you subconsciously remember. Where the hell am I? Where's the tower? Oh. You know, there's a lot of memories that, you know, you just remember, but like don't actively remember, if that makes sense. They're like in your brain. You just, you know, can't retrieve them for whatever reason, except for when you're dreaming, I guess. Remember you and your buddies caught World of War themed handshake? <laughs> That's fun. What is that? How does that? What would that even mean? A world at war themed handshake. No, no, no! Don't fall. Okay, we're good. Oh no! I need the I need torrent. Sometimes you dream you're working, then you wake up and have to go to work. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember my dreams too often, to be honest. Like, I'll remember them, you know, when I wake up and then I just forget, like, most of them. Unless there's a recurring theme, like, again, like, going back to high school for no reason. Took one of the idle animations from the character and put it in the shake. Ah, okay. Your reoccurring themes flying. That's a cool one. Better than high school. But I, I can't even, like, remember the last dream I actually remember, you know? Because you dream a lot. Every night. Just, you know. I think you have to wake up during your dream to remember it or something like that. Did that burn you? No. Does not. Ah, oh, this guy. This guy's awful. Can I get him to just yeet himself off? No. Unfortunately not. Oh, he just did. You were flying over people in your high school? Uh, sure. We can count that one, I guess. 
still probably more enjoyable than dreaming about school. I think that's a common one, though. I think, like, you know, dreaming about school is, like, being late for an exam or failing an exam or whatever, you know? That's pretty common when you're, like, in school, not after you've graduated, like, almost a decade later. Although I don't think I've had one of those dreams in a while. It's probably been like a year or so. I always wanted to do uh, lucid dreaming too. Because I, I loved the idea of that. I never really got into it though. Like I, I tried to at one point and just... I think I had one lucid dream after I'd stopped trying to get into it, and then I was just so bored, I just, like, put myself up. Because apparently I just couldn't think of anything I wanted to do. <laughs> it's a weird experience, though, when you know you're dreaming. At least when you're not used to doing it. Ow. Dude. Chill. Do I trigger item? Like, yeah, I mean, I not, I haven't done it in a while, so I, I, I used to do, like, the reality checks they tell you about, like, turning on light switches and whatnot, but I haven't done it in, like, probably a decade or so. Once a month you suffer from sleep paralysis? What is that, where you, like, wake up and you just can't move? That's gotta be pretty, pretty terrifying. Bleed. Right, I'm gonna take these off then. So I don't think we're getting another bleed. Maybe poison him again. someone crouching on the end of your bed and feet smiling at me? That's creepy. Patches. <laughs> That'd be horrifying. Alright, I think we are good with Kaelid. For now, anyway. Is the music still going? I don't think I missed anything. You were there for a long time. Tippy Mariner's dead. Black Blake. Yeah, we should be good. All right. Margit. Margit. Godric.
So, so what is it? sleep paralysis? Is what is it like seeing things and like how's that work? Because it sounds to me like it's just like you're paralyzed, like you wake up and you still can't move. But can you, you actually like see things? That's creepy as hell, man. That sucks. Alright, poison. Is he poisoned already? Wow, that was really quick. Me bleed. Wow, it's another stagger. Boom. Your mind wakes up before your body. Oof. Crazy. Yeah, I don't think I've ever had that. Figured, uh, oh no, almost 60. How many even on arrows? 99 bleed, sick. So the urine shouldn't be too bad. Most of it, anyway. Oh, I forgot about those. Usually keep your eyes closed because you don't want to see anything. Yeah, don't blame you. How long does it last usually? Just like, like a minute or so? Or does it like take a while? Or less? When you can't move, it feels a lot longer. Yeah, I, I imagine. Honestly, if you don't do anything for like a minute, a minute feels like a really long time. Like you don't, I mean, literally nothing. If you're just sitting there not looking at anything, just like waiting for a minute to go by, it's so much longer than you think it is. Like 
sitting in music theory class. <laughs> Give me a bleed! I gotta bleed. That was a lot of arrows. That was like 62. 62 bleed, not even uh, the other one, poison. Alright. Onward! So Limgrave is done. Completely. I'm gonna try to make these bleed arrows last. I think I'm just gonna switch to like normal ones for a bit because most of the stuff in Lyurnia shouldn't be too bad. We'll do poison too. I have a Discord. Uh, I don't even know at this point. I I did. I haven't used it in a long time though. I don't know if there's a link to to one in the description or something, or like in the, I don't know what you call it, like under the stream. If there's not, then not really, because I, I haven't been in it in probably like two years. Like there is one, it's just I don't even have a link to it, I guess. I just never use Discord. Where am I going? I don't know, maybe someday I'll have one again, or, you know, use it or whatever, but right now, no. I'm just like randomly expecting to die when I get to the bottom of something. Like I'm worried if I get to the bottom of this too quickly, I'm just going to randomly die. It's happened before. I think it happened in a new, in a, I think it was new game. And we're going to get the academy key. I thought I was safe and then I just randomly died hitting the bottom, hitting the ground. Poison Bloom? Sure, I'll take that. Actually, like, not bad to have. I mean, I can buy Poison Arrows now, so I don't really need it, but... Why not grab it? Dude, stop. Why can't this guy get poisoned? The nice thing about bow only runs too in, in NG Plus is that everything gives you a ton of souls. So like you never really have to worry about farming anything. Farming souls for arrows or anything. The only thing you need to farm in this is ingredients. This 
and I will not get poisoned. Surprised it didn't hit me. The Winged Sword Insignia. I do not know if that's going to be any good for this build. I feel like it probably won't. You probably need a melee build for it to actually do something. I'm guessing, anyway. It's like the first time I didn't get poisoned in that fight in maybe forever. Oh yeah, there's a random lobster over here too. I can't remember where though, but it surprised me I think the last run just like showed up randomly. I don't know where it is though. Here, somewhere. Mm. No clue. These NPC fights are going to be miserable. This one might not be that bad, but like some of them are going to be awful. He gets hyper armor during that. That's not cool, man. Got wild strikes going. Shouldn't take too long to poison him. I imagine. I think you can poison NPCs pretty quickly. Assuming you can actually hit them. Yep, it's poisoned. Even this guy's light rolling. Why do all the NPCs get light roll? This guy's in like the heaviest armor in the game. And he's light rolling. Oh, no more Estos. Whatever it's called. You catch flame me. Oh, dude, there's gonna be so many miserable NPC fights. Vike is gonna be awful. Vike's probably gonna be the worst, to be honest. Well, Gideon, I guess, but. No, not even Gideon, I can punish during Scarlet Aonia. On the plus side, we probably won't see a bow run for a while, so get a nice break from that after this one. And again, the only reason this one's so close to the black bow is because of uh, there being two different types of bows. Well, three, I guess, if you count great bows. Five, if you count ballistas and crossbows. We will. We haven't seen crossbows or ballistas yet, but I think those will be different enough. Especially the ballista runs. Crossbows you can dual wield, plus, you know, you gotta get bolts, I assume, in slightly different places, so it'll be a little different. It'll probably be harder, honestly, than a bow run, I imagine. But it's kind of funny that we got a bow run in uh, Demon Souls and then immediately an Elden Ring after that. Still haven't seen a bow in Dark Souls 2. We did a crossbow, but no regular bow. Uh, what else? Dark Souls 3, I don't think I've done any bow. Bloodborne really just has Simon's bow blade, that's it.
where do you drop down? It's right there. I guess it's right here. Did I fix the controller issue? Yeah, I got a new one. It's so nice not having to worry about it anymore. I keep thinking he's going to do a different attack for some reason. I can play well. Yeah, it's pretty dark in here. At least in like half of it. It's very bright in the middle and then the rest of it's like kind of dark. I would like to land a hit, please. Not gonna happen. Dude, he's just, he's just so squirmy. It's so hard to hit him. There we go. Right, Death bird. Nighttime. Yeah, so once this runs over, like I said, we had uh, that DS1 run. I think this had it probably a couple hours ago at this point, but we'll have that DS1 run with Stone Great Axe, which I probably am gonna... I think what I'll do for that one is I'll just get to the DLC and then just put it on pause for a bit and then I'll farm the Great Axe off stream because it's got like a 2% drop rate. It's not very good. It's from, like, probably one of the toughest enemies in the DLC. Which, I don't know what that even means. They could die in, like, three hits for all I know. But, you know, it's something I don't want to farm on stream. I don't, I just, I really don't want to do, like, any farming of anything on stream, ideally, if I can help it. But sometimes I kind of need to, like, that Demon Souls Lava Bow start. Although there's an hour of that that's not going to go on YouTube because it's literally just me running into a barrel for an hour getting in souls. Like, even the farming that I'm doing here, some of it's not going to go on YouTube just because, you know, it's not really uh, that exciting. So I try to avoid putting any farming on there. Bone Smasher. I don't think I... I'm trying to remember. Yeah, I guess some grass. 
maybe. For me, like that, the Necromancer World 4. Demon Souls, I'll, I'll do that a lot. I'll like, between like hourly segments, I guess. That's what you want to call them. That's how I try to structure it. I'll do like some farming. And that part, sometimes like it makes it in, but not always. Flame Lurker fight, yeah, that one was rough. But yeah, I probably farmed grass between uh, like two of those videos. And really, it doesn't take that long. It's just something that doesn't really need to be there because you probably already seen me do it at that point at some or, you know, at some point in the video. So you already know what I'm doing. It's like, why am I gonna waste people's time? There's a lot of time wasting in the lava bow run in the beginning. <laughs> I literally spent two hours trying to get through uh, the beginning area. Actually, it was three because the third hour is the part I'm going to cut out. It was rough. That was probably the, like, the hardest start to a run I've ever had to do. And not even because like the damage or anything was bad or the game is tough. It's just you do not get enough souls for arrows in World 1. Or in 1-1, one, one specifically. And the crossbow run, I'm genuinely worried is not going to be possible. I was testing it on that save character at NG plus 2, and I was dealing like 27 damage to, Phal to the Hoplites in Phalanx's fight. And the fact that it's so slow, like, I legitimately don't know if it's possible to do. It's gonna be rough. Please, no. Like, at New Game, you can do it. At New Game Plus is the question. I haven't a clue. No secrets lie with me, not a one. All right, you gotta talk faster. Oh, I'm gonna talk to him, because, like, I think killing him would take too long. <laughs> Yeah, Demon Souls is pretty stingy with its souls. At least, like, in the beginning. It, I don't think they really knew how many souls to give, to be honest. It's just weird. Like, 4-1, the skeletons give you, like, 200-something. And then in 1-1, one, one, you get, like, 9 from the dudes there. It's so... It's just all over the place. This guy infant reads, really. Was not expecting it from you. Capra Demon, but smarter. Surely you can poison this guy. Wow, nine damage per tick. That's pretty bad. I guess it's percentage based, though, so. Put two and two and two and two together. Yeah, it's it's like Capra Demon with a little little extra. Obviously, you have the fire attack. You have the triple slam, which is different from the single slam. And he might be a little faster, a little more uh, agile. Mildred and all her Evas all the way to Anastasia. Is is uh, she in Dark Souls three? I play offline in Dark Souls 3, so, like, if you're offline in Steam, you never see any invaders. I'm pretty sure she's also in, uh, Demon Souls in Valley of Defilement. I, I think, I think there's an NPC that kind of is, like, very similar with the Butcher's Knife. I don't know if it's called the Butcher's Knife, but it looks like it. I never got more fire arrows, did I? Yeah, we'll do some fire arrows here. I don't think you can poison these things. A mad woman. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can't. I can't remember. 
I know for DS3 there's a bunch of runs where I'm gonna have to like kill invading NPCs for various things. Like the Hazel pick, I think I need to either kill or summon Yellowfinger Hazel, I think that's her name, for a fight. Can't remember though. Fire arrows are doing work. Kind of. We fight the guys who are wings out of nowhere. Are you talking about Hazel or are you talking about. Oh, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Okay, okay. I remember her now. Yeah, she's near, like, a, a set of armor in the weapon, I think. It's probably, like, all... I don't know if it's the same stuff that she's using, but it's... I, I know where she is. Like, you have to drop down and fight her or whatever. Yeah, I always forget about that NPC. Never hear this much of the music. This thing's always dead by now. That's one of the nice things about this run. We're gonna hear like all the soundtracks fully. I like her Elden Ring character the most. Yeah, she invades like three times, I think. Once in Kaled, once in Gelmir, and then the third time's in the snowfield. I don't know if there's any more though. Those are the only three I know, I should say. But I think that might be all, all the places she invades. Brum really likes reusing names, too. Butcher's Knife used to be your main weapon of choice. I think I used the one in DS3. I wouldn't say I really have a main weapon of choice, honestly. I just, you know, especially with this, I'm always using so many. I never really stick to one. For me, it's like I have the, the first playthrough weapon. That's, I guess, the closest thing to that. But, you know, I never go back to those characters. Unless we get a DLC... But, you know, this is the only game I've played where there wasn't a DLC that might get one, because every other Souls game I played after all the DLC was out. I do want to go back to my first Dark Souls 1 character to see what other weapon I used before the Swyhander, Hander, because I, I must have used something. I don't think I started with it. The Trilogy, it's the Battle Axe. That's a nice one, too, because it's like... You usually get it right away. Like, I think every... Maybe not DS2, but I think uh, DS1 and 3. You can start with it. If I'm not mistaken. Demon Souls 2. And this game, actually. But I used a... Uh, I used the Lord Sworn Greatsword for, like, the majority of my playthrough. Then I switched to the Black... Gargoyle Black Blades. For like the end game, which was a big mistake because that weapon was not very good. Might be better with the twin blade buff though. Yeah, you can. I mean, you can use anything honestly in in these games and do fine. Hang on, I'm not ready. One shot? Come on, what the hell is this? 
Uh, I actually don't know where it is. Here? Here. Dude, stop! How long would it take to kill this Crucible Knight? A long time? Yeah, that's not worth it. Yeah, I think my DS2 run, I used just like a random hand axe. A raw hand axe. <laughs> Nothing crazy, and I just carried me. Well, it didn't carry me, it wasn't easy. Yeah, I never, I never really used the elemental affinities. I did heavy for the Lord's Horn Greatsword. The Black Blades, I couldn't put a, no, I couldn't put an infusion on. It's a somber weapon. But I think I did heavy for the broadsword in DS3 too, and I think Dex probably would have been better. But like I, yeah, you know, I didn't know anything. I don't know why I did raw for the hand axe. Fifty-three. What does a normal R1 do? 153. Okay, so they both deal the same damage. Well, that's just dealt 139. What the hell? Okay, maybe they don't both deal the same damage. 150. Not 150. He's angry. That just has like an enormous AoE, huh? That's cool, I guess. Full smash. Sparag coming up. Ugh. That's gonna be a bleeder. What's his face? Borealis is gonna be like so awful to fight. I'm gonna deal no damage to him. It's not for a while though. He's gonna need to be bleeded, rotted, poisoned. Can't freeze him, so. Like, <laughs> this just hits you no matter what. Alright, barrage him. How many bleed arrows do I have? I have 89. That'll probably be enough. 99 of these, plus another 200 in storage. And we got Crystallians coming up too. And then after that, I'll probably farm more bleed arrows. Because <laughs> we're never going to have enough. 
I'll probably do that off stream too after uh, maybe over the weekend. Just get like a bunch of blood rose. So we're good for the rest of the run. Or, you know, at least a while. Problem is I uh, can't do that for like the cold arrows. Is that blood rose? That is so random. Why are there blood rose here? I mean, I'll take it, but it's like, what? I know the rose church is nearby. The rose church is kind of far though from from like a grace or anything. I don't know that it'd be worth it. Yeah, we can shoot that, I guess. Actually, that's not that bad. Well, it's also like a bunch of headshots. So. Poisoned. Yes. Big lead. This is faster than bowls. Wow. Do I guess regular arrows for watching the columns, crystallians, we'll poison him too. So Elden Ring, I think it's next week. It's having a um, like a one year anniversary thing somewhere in Europe. And, like I was hoping we'd see DLC, but the more I think about it, I don't think it's gonna happen. I think every year, at least what I I've heard, they do like you know a show for or something for the one year anniversary. So, who knows? I mean, maybe maybe we get something announced, but I also feel like they're kind of wait till Armored Core is out to actually announce anything. But who knows? Maybe there is no DLC. The thing is, Miyazaki at the Game Awards said they are planning on doing more, so. Usually a specific in-game event? I don't know. There have been in the past. I think DS2 had some in-game events. I don't know if DS3 did. That'd still be pretty cool, though. Limited edition things that you probably could bring in the cheat engine anyways later. But still. Still cool. Good for console players. Poison, go up through this dude. It's kind of funny you can poison these guys. I don't know why, I just feel like they'd be immune to, you know, everything. Really? But apparently not. Come on. Should be broken soon. Poison makes a difference either. For uh breaking them.
but I guess I don't really know. I think if it did, this guy would break in like another couple hits. Stop jumping, sir. Oh, he actually get, got poisoned again. Well, I don't think he would. Especially after he just broke. Right there. I figured, you know, the rest of the arrows to finish him off would, uh, not poison him. Crystal Riddledice. Alright. I don't think we're missing anything else over here. I think we're gonna go and farm. More Blood Rose. 